The engine was a 426 cubic inch engine, so it was kind of a heritage statement. So we thought what would be appropriate to do is, is find a vintage um, vehicle and bring it in and modernize it. So um, it was a fusion of, of historic, uh, a historic vehicle with an infusion of like modern componentry. It's a, it's a hand-built motor, it's a 426 cubic inch, it's an aluminum block engine. So. Um, our demons, our demon product is a, a cast alumina or cast uh, cast iron block. So there's a, a significant weight reduction uh, using this block. Also, there's a, a three liter supercharger. The demon is a 2.7. So to give you an idea, we took a Hellcat lamps and, and plugged them into the backside, so you can see the halos come through the center portion there. So neat features on the front. Also, if you see uh, the hood there. It's got some DNA from the demon hood. We took the front wheel and moved it forward two inches. So it gives the car a little bit longer and lower appearance. Uh, another cool thing is you notice we shaved the door handles. So the door handles are all shaven. Um, took this uh, key cylinder lock off the back. Um, the drip rail was removed from the vehicle, so it's a nice integrated uh, touch here. Stock um, stripe, it's really the, the original stripe uh, of the car, but we just cleaned it up. Now one of my favorite features on this car is the, the tail lamps. The tail lamps are, are now gone, they turn into exhaust. We designed a really cool logo for the car, so uh, the elephant logo, and it's repeated all over the vehicle. It's looking at all the uh, the Dodge products and SRT products and the Mopar uh, parts bins and just trying to inf infiltrate this car and it all seems to work at the end.